Hi, I'm Brian Van from Sport Bike Track Gear, sportbiketrackgear.com. Today we're going to do a video review on the Scorpion ExoWear Intake Mesh Textile Jacket. Start off with a note on size of 5 feet 11 inches tall, about 200 pounds with a somewhat athletic build and wearing a size large in this jacket right now. I would like to mention that I still have the removable quilted liner in the jacket because that does have an effect on sizing for sure. Front view, side, good mobility. Right, good sleeve length. Back view, reach for the controls, works quite well. And then back to front. The intake jacket is going to be good over a multitude of seasons, right? Mesh, huge mesh panels here on the arms, sides of the jackets, these really cool intake vents here, right, are going to make this thing great in the hot weather with that liner removed. I really like the vents that they've done here because they serve a dual purpose. It still works as a pocket, right? But that is a complete intake vent on both sides. You blend that with the mesh here on the arms, sides of the jacket. You'll see the mesh on the back too. We'll really detail that in the second part of the video. This jacket is going to flow a great amount of air, so it's going to work really good in the hot and warm weather. The liner it has is a combination windproof quilted liner. It's a full sleeve and vest liner, completely removable, right? The outer portion of it is the windproof part, inner portion is the quilted body warming part. When you install that in this jacket, okay, it's going to block all the wind so it kind of negates the mesh panels, right? So you're not going to have any windshield effect, basically. And then you have the quilted body warming liner to help generate and retain some heat inside there. That is going to allow you to use this when it's cool and maybe even a little bit to the cold side depending on, on where you live and, and what your idea of cold is. But you're going to be able to use this jacket for three to maybe four seasons depending upon where you live. And that's nice because it helps really enhance the value that the product offers which is a good thing for sure. Arm adjuster. It's got a real cool design to the arm adjuster. The way they've kind of done this, it pleats up nicely. That's a nice feature to have when you remove that inner liner so you still retain a really good fit here in the arm, okay? Because remember, when you pull that quilted liner out, it's going to be a little more spacious on the inside. So you can tidy that up. It's got a cool TPR pull, neoprene cuff on the sleeve, more of a ballistic style nylon with super fabric, very abrasion resistant panel here in the elbow. Same deal up here in the shoulder. Tons of protection built in. Got kind of a Napoleon style, right, storage pocket here, right, check that out, left side, that's cool to store things, waist adjustment system, standard Velcro style, we're used to seeing, right, stay tuned for the second part of this video, we're going to pull this jacket apart, give you a great look from the inside out, I really, really like this one, it's part of a great crop of men's jackets for the fall of 2011 from Scorpion. Great stuff. This one in particular I think is pretty sweet because you've got the best of almost every single world here, right? Not really a, a great, you know, waterproof jacket, right? I don't know that I'd buy this to ride around in friggin' thunderstorms, but I think for everything else, this is going to work out great. Stay tuned for the second part and we'll show you the inside out. Alright, here we go with the Scorpion XO Wear intake jacket from the inside out. As always, we'll start with the armor. CE certified, Sostec armor, ventilated, moldable, low profile, and very productive. You're going to find that in the elbows, forearms, and in the shoulders as well. Nice coverage area for both. Got a medium density perforated foam backpack comes stock with a jacket, okay? Reasonable measure of protection. For those of you that prefer a higher level of protection, you want to integrate it into the jacket. What we have found is that the Knox TP2 CE Certified Back Protector, part number 66, fits in the jacket pretty well. Okay, we tried it on a size large, fit in the jacket pretty well. What we have here, a couple layers of energy absorbing foam, We've got some polypropylene honeycomb cells sandwiched in between, moldable, flexible, very protective, CE certified. It's a nice complement to the stuff that you find in the elbows and in the shoulders. Once again, Part number 66, you can find it in the Knox Armor category on our website if you are inclined to make that purchase and upgrade. Liner for the jacket. This comes with a combination quilted liner, 
and windbreaking liner. Okay, windbreaking outer shell, quilted body warming liner on the inside. Scorpion also incorporates a nice measure of their quick wick moisture wicking material all down the back of the jacket. That's an area where most of us sweat, right? This will help collect that moisture and move it away from your body to keep it cool and comfortable. The liner is easy to remove and reinstall, right? You've got a full zip, grab it on the bottom, pull it all the way across the shoulders, down the other side, and we have color-coded snaps, spring-loaded metal snaps for both sleeves, right? And then we have here, base of the jacket, more metal snaps on both sides to keep the liner in place. The shell of the jacket itself for the intake. Start at the back. Reflective Scorpion logo there down in the center of the back. Two mesh panels right here. Free flowing air. Got a higher veneer, right? Nylon material all in the other areas that you see there, the high impact abrasion areas, right? Mesh panel all down the side of the jacket. Waist adjuster. It's got a cool little TPR Scorpion logo there to tidy it up. Super fabric. Overlays are used on a Raglan style shoulder. Very abrasion resistant, okay? So it just increases the level of protection this jacket can offer. Got a Scorpion logo, kind of raised Scorpion logo there in the textile. Once again, they used a heavier D material here in the arm for impact and abrasion resistance. We have more super fabric overlays here in the elbow area. Cool Scorpion logo, stitched in from the inside out, it's inlaid in, it looks great. Neoprene, rolled neoprene here in the cuff, feels good against the skin. Large panel of mesh all up the arm, cool arm adjuster, we showed you that in the first part of the video. Big mesh panel here in the front of the jacket. That cool vent pocket combination they're using, I think that's pretty slick, right? Another zippered storage pocket right here, okay, kind of Napoleon style, right? It's got a cool collar on the jacket too, combination of textile and rolled neoprene. Scorpion logo is screen printed there, a little one embossed right there. If you look at the inside of this neoprene collar, very comfortable against your skin. Here's a look at the interior liner of the jacket with the removable liner taken out, nice mesh. Feels good against the skin, zipper storage pocket here, left side of the jacket. Here's a look at the right side of the jacket on the inside. All in all, what do we think of the intake jacket? We think Scorpion's done a great job of this. This is a great blend of functionality and protection. I feel that the, the quality of their ExoWear is some of the best stuff out there right now. This, this is, in particular, a really nice jacket. You could use this thing throughout multiple seasons for a lot of us in the country, you can actually use this jacket for your entire riding season with that insulated windbreaking liner and this mesh outer shell, okay? Good amount of protection with the super fabric, the Sostec stuff, it's a good jacket. If you're into it, buy it, you're gonna like it. I'm Brian Van from SportBikeTrackGear.com. This is the Scorpion ExoWear Intake Textile Jacket.